spotted a Subaru, so of course I have to go film it. Found it. Found a Subaru. What's your name? Cody Miles. Cody. Tell me about your car. Um, it's a 2007 Subaru STI. It's uh, urban gray metallic. Um, I got this car as a daily, and it quickly evolved from there into a track hobby, as a lot of cars do. But one of the unique things about it, it's on air suspension. It's running Airlift Performance uh, 3H management system on Airlift Performance struts. So it's pretty unique. It's a time attack race car by this point, and it's on air. So not a ton of, not a ton of time, time attack cars out there are on air. So it's pretty unique to be able to show it off a bit and race it. Um, I'm out here at the last round of Redline Time Attack. Everything's going pretty well, but I just killed a head gasket. So the car's done for the weekend. It's done for a few months. So it's about time to take it home, pull the transmission, pull the motor, and redo things for next season. Next season I'll be doing uh, Global Time Attack, traveling to the East Coast a little bit, uh, Redline as well. So feel free to come down to any event you see me at, say what's up. I'm happy to talk about it. Motor-wise, I've got built internals, obviously. Uh, Turbo is a Borg Warner EFR 7163. Uh, right now it's on pump gas, putting out 400 to the wheels. Um, other than that, it's just, in motor-wise, it's just supporting mods to make everything reliable. It's not just a freeway queen that is capable of going fast, but it, I gotta be able to beat the hell out of it, basically, and have it stand up. Um, Suspension-wise, as I mentioned, it's on airlift performance uh, kit with the new 3H management. Um, it's basically, the suspension utilizes a height and a pressure-based system. So a lot of times you'll have a height system or a pressure system, but right now on this car I can monitor height. I have height sensors mounted all over the chassis, connected to arms, and I've got pressure on each bag as well that I can adjust on the fly. So that's pretty unique there. Um, tires, it's got Hankook RS3s. I've pretty much run a whole season on that type of tire. Uh, it's got an APR wing with some custom end plates that I made. Um, the wheels are actually Rotas. I know a lot of people make fun of me for Rotas, but I've bent several of them and I continue to just buy more of them. I'd rather buy Rotas than Volks. Sorry, I know there's gonna be a lot of haters for that. Um, they're 18 by nine and a half. Interior, I've got Racetech RT1000 seats, uh, auto power, four point uh, roll bar, um, some Team Tech harnesses, pretty much gutted the rear of the car uh, basically to make it the best that it could be for uh, the street class here in uh, Redline. It's kind of the same like Redline and, and Global Time Attack kind of run the same type of standards for street class, limited class, modified class, whatever it might be. Uh, so yeah I've got this car set up right now for street class and so far it's doing pretty good. Um, got the, I've got the point and sleeve so far for the season so I'm hoping to go faster next season basically. Thanks for watching guys. Uh, I'd like to throw a huge thanks to most of all Airlift Performance. They've been a huge help in the entire build of this and making sure that I can keep racing. So thanks guys. Um, also we've got Aeromotive, Pure Oil, uh, Injuku Racing, Singular, Treadwear. Thanks to all you guys. It's awesome. Um, all the help I've been getting. Um, if you'd like to check it out further, keep updated with it, check me out on Instagram, uh, Sideways and Smiling. Cody, nice to meet you buddy. Thank you. You. All right, that was some cool guys. Thank you for showing me your car, by the way. Uh, amazing build, really cool. I wish I could do that, but I just can't justify the cost of making my car a non-daily anymore. I just got a package. It is actually my, let's open this with one hand here. Power strip. Got a power strip, got a USB port. Needed this for the, uh, the gaming setup over here. I literally could probably make an unboxing video almost every other week because I buy, I wouldn't say a lot of stuff, but I do buy stuff for work in the business. So oftentimes I get a lot of cool things, but here's a USB port just to show you guys real quick. I'm not gonna turn this into an unboxing video. Bam, super excited about this one. I needed this one really bad because I needed a powered power port. If you guys see right here, I'm going to, I don't like plastic on my stuff. For one day, we had a temporary setup right here of the power cord, and then uh, now we got this one, the Belkin surgery protector, so let's straighten this up. Right, Zuby? Well, I managed to do a little bit. Took the wires from up there, bundled it there, brought it back down, power strips right here, and everything's pretty clean now. Look what Iris got me. Black Ops 3, Fallout 4, Tomb Raider. We haven't played Tomb Raider since, like, back in the days. Black Cocks, I mean Black Ops, played 2. <laughs> I've never played Fallout 4, but everyone so says it's really weird. fun. 
Let's give this a try, guys. I seriously love Amazon. This is like one day shipping. I got this thing because I needed a stand for my phone and a charger for my watch. This is the coolest thing. This one is actually a remote. I just needed a second remote because we only have one Xbox One remote right now. So we got this one because she liked the color scheme of it. I thought it was really nice. Check it out. Nice. Kind of goes with the Call of Duty theme. We don't have Advanced Warfare, but we do have Black Ops. Let's play. When I was a kid, I was real poor. So we didn't get to uh, buy a lot of stuff. So now I get to buy my own stuff. And it's kind of a trip because when I was younger, when I'd open these boxes up, I'd like flip out because I'd study the box. I'd look at it because you would cherish every single moment of it. Not to say I don't do it now, but now I get to buy my own stuff and this is pretty. A little gold buttons. This is for Irish. She wants to play some games. We're actually loading up uh, Mortal Kombat X right now. So let's load this up. Update now. We're going out, taking the Range Rover today. Can I show you guys my outfit? New Primal Season. Look at this one. Color combo is really cool. Those goats are sheep. Why are they just on the side of the road? That's cool. They took them there. Next to the waterways. Hey look, it's Torin. He's here, we're gonna meet him for lunch. So first stop today, we gotta get out of the car, tight squeeze. We are going to Thai Twist, it's right behind me. And uh, Chino Hills. Torin. Hey. Thai hey, Twist, guys. So it is 11.30 and the restaurant supposedly was supposed to open at 11.30, but not even there. So we have to find a new place to go to. Where do we go? Green banana leaf, maybe? Okay, I guess we're gonna try banana leaf. Oh, okay, never mind. we're looking at the menu. This place is nice. Filipino food, if you guys haven't had it, it's pretty good. Okay, never mind. We are just gonna go to Guppies, guys. I think Guppies is a pretty safe bet. Taiwanese, right? Taiwanese beef noodle stew or soup. Or something. Delicious. She's got minced pork and Henry's got fried pork. Oh, this is, is that yummy. blood cube? No, that's a beef. I feel like we are always putting crap together all the time. And right, check it out. Almost done, almost done. Ooh, finished the table. Let me peel off this sucker right here. And we'll be done. Just like peeling off your skin, Henry. Oh yeah, after a good summer day. <laughs> Holy crap, look what just arrived. Let's open this bad boy. This is actually for videos. Because I edit a lot for you guys, I needed a wider monitor to work a little bit faster. So I bought this one, but it also doubles as a gaming TV. It's a little bit small, but We'll try this out. If it doesn't work out, we will return it or else I will shank somebody. I like unboxing stuff. This is not an unboxing video, but it is about unboxing. Awesome. What are these instructions in the Ching Chong Chang? I don't understand what you're saying. I'm just gonna go ahead and do this myself. It says do not open it like this, but I will open it like this. I will one hand free open this. Look at that. So here is yeah, you heard me. The bad boy, the word I keep using. But here is the bad boy. Um, it's a little small, as in like height-wise, but it's long. Because when I edit video for you guys, I'm using Final Cut Pro. So my timeline is down here, and it's super long. I found myself minimizing, expanding, minimizing the timeline all the time. So I'll be using this, hopefully more efficient. And then once I get another monitor for gaming only, the plan is to, well, the plan is to make this monitor a vertical monitor. So it'll be like all vertical. So that way I can like mon monitor my chat room for the live stream. And then the big monitor, which is not this one, but the big monitor will be for the actual gaming. So this is like a temporary setup. It was not expensive at all. That's why I ended up picking it up. I told myself I wouldn't buy it, but it was like next to nothing. Uh, oh, bad news. The computers at Primal Driven Headquarters broke. So I have to go out and buy a new one. I have to, like, I don't even want to. It's not in our budget, but I have to. I did it. So the general idea tonight is uh, to, we're gonna go to a drive-in movie theater. Watch Goosebumps. Henry's up above uh, grabbing our chairs so Henry and or some of us can sit outside while we watch the movie at the drive-in. I haven't been to a drive-in like forever, but we'll take you guys with us today. So instead of helping Henry, I'm busy trying to film for you guys. Yep. We're here now. All right, do I go left or right? It's a question now. Okay, so so we're here at the movie, drive-in movie right now. If you guys can see this, I know it's dark, but just bear with me. 
We're having a full on dinner here. We bought Chinese food and they were watching a movie out here with all the cars. We have to kind of see it. Isn't that badass? There's other movies going on right now too. Pretty. Thank you. I'm gonna finish. Let's finish it because it's. I got my Chinese food. We're gonna be and then we've got the movies. Henry's sitting over here and Iris is right over here Eagle. having soup. It is. Sometimes when I get upset, I, uh, For now. Have been known it is to, uh, freaking cold out here, by the way. But I do have a blanket with me. Well, that was a good movie. Yeah. The car died over there. That's too bad. Time to head home, guys.